all right guys what's going on guys it's your boy Cree here bringing you guys another quick little borderlands 3 video in this video i'm going to be going over the moxie exclusive smg the crit it's, an, it's a sub machine gun that you get obviously by tipping moxie i can arguably say that it's definitely one of the better weapons that moxie can give you by tipping and on top of that you have a really high chance of getting an annoying one right now at the moment while we still have the like an, like increase anointed drops going on so make sure to go ahead and try and get one now make sure you get one anointed you know real quick before the the event ends oh uh, real quick i am going to go ahead and put up the one on screen that i have been using so to start things off uh, here we have it we got 480 damage 83 percent accuracy 58 percent handling a three second reload time a fire rate of 12 uh, rounds per second it seems 44 to the mag um, and then the other additional perks we got here, the big one obviously is the 150% critical hit damage, which is awesome. A 27% uh, weapon fire rate, a 20% weapon charge speed, it is, it is a Malawan weapon, so you know all Malawan weapons they have a charge speed, which is kind of lame, but it is what it is. Uh, this one also is anointed, as I said earlier, this one's anointed to the Beastmaster, ironic. Uh, after using Rack Attack, you see what I'm saying? Gain 25% critical hit damage for a short time, so helps out a little bit. I also want to mention a few things hey about marker. the crit. This puppy can come in both a uh, rare, like you know the blue, or epic, the purple uh, rarities. It doesn't come in legendary, obviously, because it's not a legendary. Um, and it only drops in shock damage, so you can't get it in any other element. No radiation, corrosive, or incendiary. Sorry, and. Honestly, out of all the like the things about this gun, I would say the only true negative I have about it is that sometimes when you go to reload it, it just drops out of your hand. Like you hear the chime and everything, the little ding, you know, when an epic hits. Yeah, that's the, that's the sound it makes whenever you go to reload it sometimes and it just drops out of your hand. So if you are going to use this gun, just keep an uh, open mind and open eye out for that, that that does happen and it's totally possible that like, you could be shooting a boss and then just ding your gun flies out your your hand and then you know that's no good uh myself uh actually i was able to grab a couple of these with under like thirty thousand dollars worth of tipping if you if you are new and you don't have a lot of money there are so many ways to get money um i have this easy video that i'll link in the description on how to easily get super amounts of money if you you know don't have a amount of money to just you know spam the triangle button over and over and over again um i i took this gun in a few different spots uh i would mainly say that this thing is mainly good and i would say the cistern slaughter um for boss damage it can be pretty well it can be really good to take to take off you know shields because it is a shock weapon and you know 150 percent crit damage that's nothing to sloth at i haven't used this gun with a crit build yet so if any y'all have um, let me know how it how it works with the crit build down below. I would be, I'm really curious. But yeah, that is just gonna about wrap things up. Let me know what you think about this gun. Is it worth picking up? Or if you have already, how do you like it? But anyways, guys, if you like the video, make sure to hit that thumbs up. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and give that bell a little bit of a love tip. That helps a lot. <laughs> My name's Kree, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out.